what's going on guys i'm coming back with another review for for this one and i have another product that again i waited a long time for to use so this product right here is l'oreal color vibrancy dual protect spray now i have to tell you it took me a long time to actually find this product i went to at least four stores to find it I've searched everywhere and I know for a fact that the only place you can find it besides online is at Ulta Beauty. They sell these at Ulta Beauty for about $6.99 I believe because I managed to pick this up which happened to be the last bottle at the nearest Ulta Beauty store. So I know for a fact that you can find this at Ulta Beauty so if you want this stuff hit there. It says here that the UV, that the, um, UV filters that it has up to here. It protects up to 450 degrees Fahrenheit, 450 degrees Fahrenheit. I say that's only if you heat style your hair and it's supposed to prevent your hair color from fading as fast and it's supposed to prevent damage. This is what the back of it looks like here and the ingredients are listed in the back along with a barcode. But I actually picked this product up because I frequently color my hair with semi-permanent hair colors. I might do a permanent hair color, but I usually color it with semi-permanent hair colors. And I kept noticing that my colors kept fading way too fast since I live in Florida and we have a lot of sunshine down here. So I decided to pick this so I decided to pick this product up here. Just to see if it'll work at making my hair color last a little bit longer before I wash it out or if it fades away. And I do have to say it did the job really, really well. It not only made my hair very soft, but it allowed my color to stay in my hair for about a week and a half up to two weeks until it started to fade. And this is coming from somebody who uses um, Manic Panic, uh, the Silk Elements semi-permanent hair color, and many other semi-permanent hair colors. So I was able to let my color last for about a week and a half up to two weeks before I either A got bored of it and decided to wash it out with the Shea Moisture African Black Soap Collection or B it just completely dulled down to this hideous mad color this horrible color and I just decided to just get rid of it and start over again but yeah and also it is I don't know if it's the camera's picking up but it's in two chambers so in order for you to use it you have to you have to shake it up first you have to shake it up and then you can use it i highly recommend spritzing this on your hands first and then distributing your hands throughout your hair especially if you have thick hair like me if you try it the other way where you shake it up and you try and spray it directly on your hair unless you have naturally straight or wavy hair this might not work out as well for you because you might miss a few spots especially if you're going out on days where there are no clouds in the air and it's a clear day clear sunny day and you don't want your color to fade so i highly recommend shaking it up first and then spritzing some of the product onto your hands and then running your fingers and your hands through your hair to make sure you get every single nook and cranny every single spot i also recommend that you don't use it that you don't use a lot of it because if you do it will make your hair very greasy now i happened to make a mistake and i used it a little too much on the second time that I used it which was a long time ago and my hair ended up appearing appear very greasy to the touch so that was a big mistake but other than that this product is actually pretty good and I can see myself purchasing this again to preserve my hair color it's it did its job it does let my hair color last a little bit longer than what it used to be and it does make my hair soft it's also pretty good as a leave-in conditioner, though I really don't use it as much, but you could try. But all in all, this product is pretty good, and I would definitely buy it again. It would just be really hard to find, but yeah, I'd buy it again. But that's my review on it. The only place I know where you can find it besides online is at Ulta Beauties for about $6.99 plus tax. Plus tax here. And yeah, that's pretty much my review on it. If you tried the product before, I'd love to hear how it worked for you. Just leave your comments in the comment section below. If you like my review, a thumbs up is always appreciated. And if you want more from me, don't be afraid to hit the subscribe button. More will be coming from me soon. So that's my review on this product, and I will see you soon.